Thanks for staying with us. You're still on to Good Morning Nigeria on the network service of the NTA. Up next is Newspaper Review. All right, welcome back to the program and you're watching Good Morning Nigeria and let me welcome Chukudu Kodi Ubaja, the newspaper reviewer as he gets said. I don't know what he's scribbling. Chukudu, good morning. Anytime, uh, anytime I want to try U UTME again so that I read a different course, you interrupt me. Were you sent to arrest my progress? Claire, good morning. Good morning. How are you Chukudu. doing? I'm okay. Demo, uh, mm -hmm. how now? I'm fine. Did you hear me? The uh, Mel. <laughs> you will become more yeah, Oyibo than Oyibo. You are try, yeah, trying to fortify my name. Im imagine the <laughs> Mel. All right, let's let's see. Um, it's the Mola. It's the Mo. It's not the Mel. Oh, it's in English. Gentlemen. Oh, it's in Africa. Let's, let's get on because we have quite a uh, well number of issues. A discussion yes, today, right? To today. Uh, leader, leadership is leading with the. Um, the security meeting, the summit uh, in the Northwest, and it says, Tinubu, Northern Governors Close Ranks Over in Security. Uh, the story is on page four, and it comes with one, two, uh, three riders. Brainstorm on new offensive against bandits and terrorists. I think the, the key word there is new offensive. We, we should take note of that. And enough is enough, says President. Approves 51 billion naira for fresh onslaught. And Sultan assures of traditional rulers' support. Uh, also, unfortunately, also trending on the front page of the leadership just on my right hand column, uh, that will be to your left. Bandits kill Danfodio Varsity Deputy Vice Chancellor. Danfodio Varsity Deputy Vice Chancellor killed by bandits. And uh, in reverse, pro police protests rock 21 local government secretariats. It's on page six. And courts here, EFCC, Kwankwaso Emirates suits, July 2 and uh, 11. Details of that on page uh, 21. And there's a picture story uh, right there, just uh, below the, the, the lead story. And that's the vice president, Kashim Shatima, with former president. Muhammad Buhari during the Northwest Peace and Security Summit at Government House Casino uh, yesterday. That summit started yesterday. And quickly, just above the nameplate, 30 trillion naira ways and means investigation not abandoned. That's from the President of the Senate uh, with the picture right there. Um, police arrest suspected killers of Army General in Abuja. That also trended yesterday. And quickly now to the blueprint. And um, the blueprint is also leading with the Northwest uh, Peace and Security Summit yesterday, but uh, leads with the killing of the uh, Danfodia University Deputy Vice Chancellor. And it, it says, Tinubu explains insecurity in the North. Bandits kills Sokoto University DVC. 35 abducted in Zamfara. President wants ideological mischief countered. And they're ready to challenge gunmen. Sultan charges subjects and uh, there are details of this story you can find on page eight cholera death toll hits 53 as fg urges states and local governments on surveillance uh that's also there and of course uh, there are also stories trending just below the nameplate uh mfla awarded contracts to own company wife indo that's according to witness and uh in sports 2026 World Cup, Super Eagles must find a way to qualify. That's a you. You can find uh, all the details about that on page 32. Sultan, an institution that must be jealously protected. That's uh, Shatima, uh, of course, uh, is trending on the uh, left-hand column. And, and, and also the picture, of course, uh, trending also. I just read, read it out. Probe of 30 trillion ways, I also just read out. And... Um, Shoprite to leave Abuja June ending. Hmm. Okay. Demola, I think I've read enough. 
You have tried. Mm. <laughs> I have the Daily Sun newspaper with me, and uh, just beside the nameplate, we have food crisis worsen. How Naira crash, insecurity smuggling, others crippled food production. Post harvest losses hit $9 billion. Farmers pay billions as ransom to terrorists. The story can be found on page 20 and 21. Tinubu admits inheriting security compromises, historical injustices. Uh, insecurity fight federal uh, responsibility governors forum tells uh, president. That is the headline uh, report there. And the story is on page 6. Federal, federal government declares cholera public health emergency as death toll hits 53. Lagos Ugu record uh, over 579 cases, intensify environmental surveillance, and federal government tells states and local government. OB suggests ways to tackle exodus of multinationals. The details of the story can be found on page 27. Anxiety mounts in Sokoto over Marik Alam on alleged plot against Sultan. The story is on page 6. U.S. military seeks West African Plan B after Niger Austin. Niger, okay. Uh, Plateau Special Force arrest gun runners, bandits. Uh, that story is on page 5. Buari's uh, 30 trillion CBN loan probe ongoing Senate. Uh, the story can be found on page 29. Well, that's, uh, that's it, Chooks. Good news for crime fighting. Um, police say they've arrested suspects in the killing of retired General Owen Udukwere <coughs> at Sunshine Homes Estate in Ka Kabusa. That's uh, an Abuja suburb. Yes. Uh, the suspects are linked to a gang of murderers and robbers. According to the police, they are said to have been terrorizing the Federal Capital Territory and its environs. So what are the takeaways? The police can act promptly and efficiently when the situation actually encourages them to do that. That is very important to take away. When you say that a retired army general is murdered, it tells you the height some people are pushing impunity to. Yes, all animals are equal, uh, but uh, George Orwell would say that some are more equal than, than others. The, than the others. A retired army general, uh, general's killing sends a very bad message to crime fighting. So police yes. tend to we, we, bring we in a lot of activity to say we you know can the do this. We security surrounding such a person. Exactly, so you can that, imagine. that's the point. And um, ordinary, you know, Thank you. Citizens. You begin to think, do we have what will happen hope? to the rabble? <laughs> but the important thing is, yes, you can dare, but we can also stop you. We must take the message holistically, you know. It's very important that we do that. And that's why, that's why government says, if you see something, say, say something. something. Because the security everybody, is a collective effort. Everybody is a crime fighter. Mm -hmm. It depends on the mentality you adopt towards the environment. So that's, that's a very good yes, one. Just before you leave that story, um, yes. yeah, reading deep into the you know, issues, there were reports that, um, or, you know, indication that those caught, the suspects, were living within the same Apo access. Hmm. Some, the Apo Panteca, some, the Apo Mechanic Village, and other, you know, areas within the Apo vicinity. So I think it's high time that the security, you know, those responsible, combed out those areas. If all of the suspects, you know, lived within the area, so that particular, uh, uh, you know, vicinity is suspect. It is. Yes. It is, so it I, is. I, 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 I will think that more effort should have, should be done. Well, I don't know if what the police is doing to also comb the whole of those, those areas and then get the suspects to also, you know, name those involved because uh, the, the story also says that there are others. Who are still on the run? Yes, you know. Yes, and and then I was also wondering, uh, Chikudi, um, the retired general should have some form of security, you know, guards guarding his area. What that's, that, that's what we just yes. talked about now. Well, that what mean, he, to them? So you can imagine. Were they then again, you know, you know, you know what happened. I was I was taking a walk. I mean, 
last weekend just around this uh, Gariki area and I saw just this little little chant shanties you know spread and I saw this kind of the caliber of people leaving I said look this is not good for this community and we're talking about fighting crime you understand the first just like you said they need to comb areas like this the first thing is that not everybody surrounding you has good intentions that is the uh, thing. towards you. The second thing is that the environment could actually be unhealthy for you. You just talked about shanties. Yeah. just well, There are some elements you should not allow to group around you. Natural suspicion is not police suspicion, which is more professional. But you can also help yourself live longer by taking proactive action concerning the events going on around you. Yeah. So what sort of vigilante arrangement do you have? How cohesive is the estate management? All those things matter. Everybody is a crime fighter of so sorts. Do you think the police uh, uh, has done well by apprehending the suspects? That prompt action um, must always be commended. And, and uh, could they also have been proactive hmm. in stopping, you know, a proactivity is a, or proactiveness is the ultimate tool of crime prevent, prevention. But then accidents will happen, certain things are inevitable, uh, the, the life is good and bad news. So whichever situation arises, they, let them try to be proactive. But when human monitoring, vigilance fails, you now have to go to the action of a to so react. who done it. We're after you and all that, you know? Yes, because uh, I, even on the news this morning, international news, there were quite a number of cases like this, mm -hmm. you know, cases of uh, killing of, you know, teenagers, you know, burning of synagogues and, and all that. And the, 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 you know, masterminders are yet to be caught. Yes. Um, anyway, let's also look at the, the Northwest Peace and Security Summit in the light of security. Very important. Yes, what, what do you think of uh, this summit? coming? Very important. Time? There are some organisms that mutate so quickly that medicine is in a hot chase to deal with, you know, such pathogens and all that. Crime in Nigeria is mutating at a point, at a rate that requires the authorities to make sure that our crime fighters, that our police force, the entire, um, you know, security people, are one step ahead of them. There's a book I read, The Mind of Mr. J.G. Reader. They asked him, how do you solve cases this efficiently? He says, I think like a criminal. So I am always ahead of them. Send the police to courses where they would be required to think like criminals so that they can be ahead of the criminals all the time. You never ever get tired of in-service training to make sure that people live up to expectation mm -hmm. and the environment at the end of the day is safe. The, 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 training, training, training. Yes, there are two things I, I, I wanted you to speak on. Uh, on the front page of leadership, it, it says a uh, brainstorm on new offensive, new offensive. New. What, what, what does that, how do you interpret that? What does it mean? New, new offense, tactics? New offensive new means new tactics, comments. new mode of operation. A new thinking about the environment, it is not all the time that kinetic, uh, 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 that's false, against false, uh, solutions work out. How much are you doing to also preempt crime by making sure that the people in the environment are not too alienated from mainstream life? That is ultimately what reduces crime, making sure that the people you bring into the net of those thinking together for society's progress is actually a very wide net. Mm -hmm. So whichever, whichever method is adopted, the important thing is that can we at the end of the day say that some reasonable efficiency has been recorded? Okay. Let them keep thinking because okay. criminals will keep on mutating, mutating their their, their, their methods. That it, it will continue. They're always thinking ahead anyway. But the Sultan, yes, I think it's the Sultan, is actually saying it will take, it will take decades to get out of banditry, Sultan laments. Hmm. He didn't uh, say it to make the police sad. Mm -mm. He's seen things happening there 
So we have a lot of job mm. to do. And there is also an approval of 51 billion naira for this fresh onslaught. That is... Which is... Go ahead. That is how the presidency can key in. Boots on the ground ultimately will become the, uh, the, 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 the weapon for fighting whatever you want to fight. So putting those boots on the ground, equipping them in terms of firepower and information gadgets. ICT has become a major component of crime fighting. The FCT minister said the other time, he found out that people could say, yes, the call was made in this district. They need equipment that says the call came from this house. These are the issues. Mm -hmm. And these are things that Nigeria can easily, uh, you know, uh, get mm -hmm. if the will is there. Look, look at, um, okay, go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Yes, I just wanted to finish the issue of security. Okay, go, go ahead. Yes. yes the, well, I want the, to talk about uh, something else. Talk okay, about the, food the, crisis. Okay, the pro-police protest in Rivers. Yes. That's rocking 21 local government secretariats. Yes. You, you, you have? Some? Yeah, the pro-police protest mm -hmm. is we are in tandem with the police over, you know, taking over the, taking over the place, blockading and all it's that. It's just this conflict that. between well, this, uh, when pro you, and Well, when you anti. do pro and anti, <laughs> that's when the element of politics creeps in. So of it depends course. on who is pro win yes. toward the police. <laughs> it depends. And, and finally, the former president is looking rather refreshed. If you see the picture. Who? The, who well, whose picture? The picture of the former president. Okay. Uh, it's it's on the front page of leadership. But, having a are very you talking warm about uh, uh, President uh, Muhammad Buhari? Muhammad Buhari. Yes. There's yes. a mischievous thing here. Uh, uh, <laughs> but, uh, actually, it's uh, Sheikh Hussani is attributed to. He said that uh, all the visit to Buhari, you know, is about unseating uh, Tinubu in 2027. And you say journalists are free to listen to all manner of talk and all that. What we are interested in is what plays out at the end of the day, which becomes our ultimate news. Well, that's, 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 uh, that, that's certainly not the focus of this picture. I'm, I'm just talking about... No, no, about, no. Yeah, I, I, no yeah. I, I, you just I, mentioned I, him. Yes, I'm and just, I, I, I'm, I, 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 I noticed there was a headline hmm. concerning all the going, uh, goings and comings in. Then this issue of food crisis recently. worsened. This food of, the, the issue of food crisis worsened. How Naira crash, insecurity, smuggling, others crippled food production in the country. You know, we talked about inflation yesterday and what an ordinary, ordinary Nigerians are going through. It's not, not easy. Even the rich are also crying at yeah. this moment. Uh, no, the, the, Demola, if you have looked carefully, mm. you find out that those you, run, you were running to Two. when you needed a bailout are now running to other people. That tells you it's a bad situation. But the thing is this, it is not your bad situation that is most important to analysts. It is the actions you're taking King. today to make sure that tomorrow gets better. What kind of input went into agriculture so that the next harvest will be a lot better? The rains did not come in time in Abuja, for instance. Abuja, a northern part of the country, that means that certain things were planted late. It's going to also push certain things being planted late, you know, toward the uh, uh, end of the Beans, for instance, may not be a, a, a first of uh, a week of August in anymore. It might go to first of September because mm. you have to pull your potatoes to replace them with beans and all, right. all that. All right. So it depends on the actions we are taking. Mm. Okay. Chukwede, thank Chukwede. you. Let's not we're, get scared we're... by our present calamities. Chukwede, we have this to is the solutions we're interested in. Uh, yeah, thank you. Thank yes. you. Uh, we have to go now. We, we're glad uh, you were able to speak to some of these issues. We'll see you tomorrow. See you guys. You're watching Good Morning Nigeria. In just a moment, we'll begin our conversations. Please don't go away.